Hello everyone, welcome to Taurus versus Taurus. In this reading, we're gonna be taking a look at how you feel about each other. To book your private reading, all of that info is below. Please follow me on Instagram. Not every Taurus watching is gonna feel like this is their message and that's okay. It's gonna be up to you to determine which Taurus you are. To my right, Taurus A. To my left, Taurus B. Okay, we're gonna start with Taurus A. Spirit, please speak to me in reference to Taurus A. Okay. So Taurus to my right is very optimistic at this time, into traveling, wanting to explore. Okay. Um, this is an energy of someone who is optimistic right now. Okay. Very outgoing, the Taurus to my right here. All right. How does Taurus to my right feel about Taurus to my left? How does Taurus to my right feel about Taurus to my left? How does Taurus to my right? Okay. So the Taurus to my right is very spiritual, okay, and is very mysterious. The Taurus to my right, even though they are presenting themselves as very adventurous, this person can't stop thinking about Taurus to my left, all right? Or I just feel like there's a lot of stress that this Taurus is dealing with, okay? I feel like the Taurus to my right has decided to go cold or not speak to the other Taurus for some reason, or there's no communication between you and the other Taurus. Um, the Seven of Wands energy. So I feel like the Taurus to my right may have been dealing with a fire sign, an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, primarily a Sagittarius energy since we have communication coming out here. It's like this Taurus over here wants to speak to Taurus on my left. However, they're just quiet right now. It's like they're waiting for Taurus on my left to reach out first. Okay, now let's talk about Taurus on my left and I have the five of pentacles in reverse. So it's like the Taurus to my left is trying to recover from something, all right? Talk to me about what Taurus to my left is recovering from. Okay, we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy. So it could be an air sign that Taurus to my left was dealing with. Or, you know, this Taurus to my left does not want a confrontation. So they're trying to stay away from that is what I'm getting here. Okay. Tell me more about the Taurus to my left. Tell me more about the Taurus to my left. Okay, so we have the Ten of Cups. Taurus to my left is really close to their family right now for some reason here, okay? And they're just focusing on, you know, their children, um, making sure that their domestic life is stable, all right? Um, they're just putting themselves first, basically. <laughs> Tell me more about Taurus to my left. Tell me more about Taurus to my left. We have the Ten of Swords, so there could have been an ending that this Taurus to my left recently went through or there's someone who passed away, okay? They're still dealing um, with their feelings when it comes to, you know, their mourning process is what I'm getting here. 
the Knight of Wands energy. Um, I feel here that with this Knight of Wands, they're trying to um, not think so much about this, but they can't help it, all right? So it's like, you know, some days are better than others, but at least I feel that um, they're trying their hardest to like put their best foot forward. And you know, that's probably why they're just focused on their family and their home life right now is what I'm getting here. Talk to me more about Taurus to my left. Taurus to my left. Talk to me about Taurus to my left. Taurus to my left is really distant as well, <laughs> okay? Um, and you're probably feeling that. I don't feel like Taurus to my left is dating other people. Okay, Taurus to my left has a lot of options. And if you're wondering if this Taurus to my left still has feelings for you, absolutely, with the Ace of Cups. I just feel like there's some sort of trauma that Taurus to my left is going through. Um, actually, you know, even though Taurus to my right has the Nine of Swords and the Seven of Wands. I feel like Taurus to my right is doing a lot better than Taurus to my left, okay? Now, what is the outcome for Taurus and Taurus here? What is the outcome for Taurus and Taurus? What is the outcome for Taurus and Taurus, please? What is the outcome for Taurus and Taurus? Hmm. I have the Seven of Pentacles, all right? And you got this as the outcome for the new person. So you might want to take a look at the new person reading that I just did. And then the Four of Cups. So I just feel like you both are indecisive right now about moving forward. Um, you both need to heal a little bit more. Um, I do feel like there's love here. Someone just rather not speak right now, okay? That's the person on this side, all right? They would rather just stay to themselves and that's okay. This person on this side, this Taurus to my right is very spiritual, okay? This Taurus to my left has a lot of love for the Taurus to my right, but something traumatic has happened to this Taurus on my left, all right? and they're working on themselves. So you both are in this process of healing, okay? I feel like it's gonna take time. Give me one more card. Give me one more card for Taurus and Taurus, please. Three of Swords, yeah. You both are in a lot of pain over something, okay? And that's all right. Um, you have to feel it in order to get over it. And I feel like you will. All right, so that's what I have for you. Thank you so much for watching. To book your private reading, all of that info is below. Please follow me on Instagram. Thank you. Take care.